What's up, YouTube Savage here, Brian here, and welcome to my very first Sonic video and stuff, and today I'm going to be discussing what if the parkour formula was combined with the boost formula and stuff, so please like this video if you do like it, and please subscribe if you do want to subscribe and stuff, so yeah, let's get into it. So if you didn't know, the parkour formula was implemented into one Sonic game, and that was Sonic Lost World. And Sonic Lost World wasn't exactly like the best Sonic game and stuff. The Wii U version of Sonic Lost World wasn't really that great, and the level design was really terrible. But for the 3DS version of Sonic Lost World, the level design was definitely an improvement over the Wii U version of Sonic Lost World and stuff. But uh, the parkour formula had lots of potential, but it was wasted and stuff. And they sort of made the parkour formula good. On the 3ds version but it wasn't as good as it should have been so so what if this formula was combined with the boost formula and how would the levels work and stuff the levels obviously would not take place on lost sex because of the fact that lost hex really sucks and no one cared about that in sonic lost world and the villains of lost hex was the deadly six really weren't that great and stuff so the level design would definitely have to be reconfigured from Sonic Lost World and they would have to make it so you can use a parkour formula and boost formula on something that isn't like a cylinder type shape that you run on and stuff. Maybe they could make it so like instead of like making it so you run on this like cylinder type thing. Maybe they can make the levels more open and stuff and with more routes and stuff and you would need to take advantage of the parkour formula to take different routes and then sometimes you would need to use the boost formula while parkouring to get to different sections of the level which I think could possibly work. I don't really know how Sega would go about this if they were actually trying to implement the parkour formula with the boost formula. But I think it is definitely something that's, that would be really cool to see because the parkour formula wasn't really like used to its full potential and the boost formula is awesome but it would be awesome to see like more like open world levels like Sonic Adventure and stuff but the parkour formula was awesome I definitely did like it even if it wasn't like the best but tell me your thoughts about what would happen if the parkour formula was combined with the boost formula and so, so yeah, without the way Savage Hero Brian out.